Hello and welcome to our YouTube channel, Miriam Leonardo Tango. In this one, we're going to again see a step that you can use for milonga rhythm. It's very useful and we are combining the video number one and the video number two here on the list and creating a beautiful figure. Before we initiate with the video, make sure to subscribe to the channel, activate the bell for notification and at the end, if you're enjoying this, a like will be great. Good, let's go to the video now. All right, now here on the dance floor, we are going to, as we promised before, we are going to combine the two previous steps that we've done for Milonga Rhythm. Let us show you. We are going to do this. Change it, always try to change her right weight first, no matter what. Side. To start all over again. <laughs> Very beautiful, you can use it a lot at the Milonga dancing milonga rhythm. I use it a lot, dancing milonga rhythm, and also rhythmic song, rhythmic tangos like Darienzo, things like that. I use it quite a lot, not as much as lifting the knee, but just for, I mean, so you know that you can use it also for tango. Now let's go to the details so you can review what we did before and put it together. Body weight change, mm -hmm. side step. Now he's going to step on my right side and lift in the position, up, change body weight with the legs straight, make the step to connect to the rock step, two feet together, and from here, change body weight because we're going to resolution, slow, quick, quick, slow. In this case, we are exiting in slow, and then yeah. syncopate. It's nicer for the followers. Yes. I, I found that sometimes the leaders are finishing the step and they go Choo, yeah, so fast and it's you have to double work to follow that it doesn't have the feeling so always when you are planning to syncopate breathe go slow prepare and then you syncopate mm -hmm. so now for the leaders so when we are doing this again i will do it i will do it a little bit diagonal so they can see from the back as well okay stop we have something to let you know we would like to invite you to check out our website, MiriamLeonardoTango.com, where we have our online tango training academy. You receive two videos every week at home, ready to practice and shine at the milonga. You can be a member of our website and access all of them, or you can also purchase them separately as a downloadable course. A beautiful opportunity to learn a lot. Now, let's go to the second part of the video. So we are doing side step one after switching body weight, of course, we are doing front change now here i'm changing her by weight going back as i'm going back you will see that i'm starting to open this left embrace left, left side so she knows that for sure we are going on that direction yes now i will send her but again my intention will start pulling to the right look tac 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 one more time only that pam 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 here is when we switch by weight there is a little rotation and knees out that will also help her to understand that we are switching body weight. Mm -hmm. Yes, that little yes helps helps her. We go out, walk, resolution, quick, quick, slow. That's for the leaders, and then you can do a small step to start all over again. Let's rotate so they can see the close embrace work and the rhythm. So we'll do reconnect here to side step. One up, change front. Rock step together, slow, quick, quick, slow. For followers, if you notice, when we do the rock step after body weight change, I, I see a lot of hips. Don't be afraid to move the hips, just be careful, don't go with the head, but you can do a little less or you can do more if you want. It's always good, it's never much, especially if it's milonga because it's happier rhythm and style. Check point here for the leaders. When you are doing this step, make sure, check if you are putting your heel down during that rock step. It's not good. So let me show you what I mean. Only that, um, that rock step to the side. Try to use only the ball of your foot. Tac, 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 tac. If you notice, I'm using the ball. As soon as you go, you place your heel down, it feels clunky. Very yeah. clunky. Feels heavy. You're going to lose right. the rhythm. 
So when you are doing that, make sure if you are doing this, check your, the ball of your foot. Especially, I feel it more almost on my toe, big toe, rather than my entire ball of the foot. Big toe and come back. Let's do it one more time without being together. Sure. So let me rotate so we can see each other here. We go side, front, change, back, pulling, pulling, and coming back, rotation, slow, quick, quick, slow. Okay guys, congratulations, you made it until the end of this video. Before you leave, if you're enjoying this, please put a like, that would be very much appreciated. Thanks so much and see you on the next one. Bye.